sync sync so good morning sir margin so th this is my entry in the uh, video assignments so first question is to get the differential for each of the following so y is equal to t cube minus 40 squared plus 70 so before I proceed can I can I let me explain for can I, uh, explain first difference I differential so we have y is equals to x cube I atom is yang I derive first so dx squared now in order to find the differential you want to atom is I divide both sides uh, I will multiply both sides by uh, dx which is mouse siya ang denominator so makancel na siya now we have dy is equal to 3 x squared dx so that's how <coughs> uh, differentials work so are you proceed ka sa atong problem oops sorry so y <coughs> is equal to t cube minus 4 t squared plus 7 t now derive sa nito sila d t is equal to um, use power rule sa kani o sa kani so we have 3 2 minus 1. Oh, sorry. 3t. 2 minus 3 minus 1. Minus 4. Alay, pagawas na natong 4. 2. T. 2 minus 1. And ang der derivation na niya is 7. Now, simplify pa dyan na to. So 3t squared minus 8t plus 7. Now, ang atom is going to multiply with dt both sides. So we have we have <coughs> 3t squared dt. minus 8t dt plus 7t so muna ni siya atong final answer now let's move on to the next problem w is equals to x squared sine 2x x of oh, sorry w W is supposed to um, let's move it here. W is supposed to x squared sine two x <coughs> <coughs> now we have to derive this first. In this formula we have to use the I think it's called the product rule, I believe. So derivation of this Oops. multiplied by a second x plus mm. x squared times cosine two x times t we have to simplify it even more x sine two times plus over here so we have two x squared of sine two x oh I 
forgot the oh no that's right now I multiply both sides by dx <coughs> we have 2x sine 2x dx plus 2x squared cosine 2x dx so this is our final answer now let's move on to the next problem so f f is, e is equal to e uh, to the power of 3 minus z to, to the 4 Now in this formula, we can solve this by using this formula E U times U prime. So basically E U minus Z to the four times the derivation of this. So the derivation of three minus Z to the four is negative 4z oh, 4z 3 so we have negative 4z 3 e 3 minus z 4 our final answer <coughs> now let's move on to the next problem a word problem a sphere was measured and its radius was found to be 45 inches with a possible error of no more than 0 0.01 inches what is the maximum possible error in the volume if you use this value of the radius so in this problem we will use mm, 4 over 3 pi r cubed <coughs> now we have to uh, differentiate this formula first equals to 4 over 3 pi Three R square dr. So I just place the dr there in advance. So basically, this cancel. So cancel three. Dv is equal to four pi R square dr. Now we have to substitute the values. DV is equals to 4 pi. Our radius is 45. Oh, 45 feet. I mean 45 inches. And our um, DR, which is the possible error, is. 0.01 inches. You put that in your calculator and you will have 254.47 cubic inches. Now let's move on to the next problem. The sides of a cube are found to be 6 feet in length with a possible error of no more than 1.5 inches. What is the maximum possible error in the volume in the cube? If you use this value of the length, the side to compute the, vo the volume. So, we will, we will 
If you are looking for the volume of a cube and the formula of the volume of a cube is simply a cube. So to differentiate this to a square here. And then we have to substitute the values. Three times our A is six feet. Six feet. Now our D, uh, our D A possible error is 1.5 inches, so we have to uh, convert it to feet, which is 0.125. Now we can put all that in our calculators, and we will have 13.5 cubic feet. The next problem the radius of a circle is found to be 7 cm in length with a possible error of no more than 0.04 cm what is the maximum possible error in the area of the circle if you use this value of the radius to compute the area so we we'll find the area of the circle which is pi r squared Now we have to differentiate this formula. So pi two r d r. So we have two pi r d r. Now we have to substitute the values. Two pi our radius is 7 cm and our dr our possible error is 0.04 cm now we have to recompute that in our calculators and we will have 1.76 cubic cm Okay, so that's all. Thank you, sir, Mike.